guys, it's Chelsea Baker, professional cosmetologist of five years. Today I'm going to show you some makeup tips for a sagging chin. So when you get a little bit older, you'll notice the skin right underneath your chin here starts to sag a little bit and you want to try and hide that when you do your makeup to give you more of a youthful look. Now she doesn't exactly have a sagging chin, but I can still show you how you can hide that. You're going to want to take a darker colored foundation, darker than what you used on your skin. I prefer a powder. It's easier to blend. It goes on smoother. And you're actually going to draw a line with your brush right underneath the jawbone. And you're going to want to do that on the other side as well. Just draw a line. Don't worry if when you put your head up, it looks like you can see it. You're not going to be able to see it when the head comes down. And you're going to want to really focus on right underneath the chin, making it as dark as possible. You're creating fake lines when you do this. It's going to give you a more defined jaw. It's going to take away from the sagging. After you've applied your line right underneath your jaw, you're going to want to take a highlighting powder, and any lighter color powder will do. It doesn't have to specifically be a highlighting powder and you're gonna brush that right on the jawbone on each side and that's gonna draw attention to the line that you just made underneath your chin. And you have to remember when you're doing makeup, light draws the eye and darkness takes it away. So we're gonna take a little more of our darker colored foundation that we used underneath our jawbone and we're going to brush that on just the tip of the chin. So all of the attention is going to be drawn to the jawbone here, and it's not so much underneath here and on the actual chin itself. Well, that's all there is to it, how to apply makeup to a sagging chin. If you have any more beauty questions, feel free to ask.